Alec, thank you so much for your time today. And I was wondering if you could give some advice to female entrepreneurs that may be trying to raise funding at the moment. I know things have changed radically in the last couple of years since I interviewed you last time. Mm -hmm. So I wondered if you've got any tips or comments or ideas for them. Yeah, you're right. I think the last few years have been very instrumental in, in kind of bringing to light uh, the fact that women were not getting funded as much as men, and I think there's just a general awareness that uh, didn't exist before. Um, but it still can be challenging for women to get their voice heard or their idea heard, uh, especially if they're targeting uh, you know, a, a female-dominated market. And I, I hear this from men, too, who are targeting um, uh, markets that, that uh, are primarily women. And I'd say uh, women should really see who else has invested in, in, uh, in markets similar to theirs. And, um, and now we have a lot more companies over the last few years. A lot of them are in the uh, e-commerce space. Um, and uh, several very prominent VCs have been backing women uh, founders in, in e-commerce uh, specifically. And, and so I'd say that um, the first thing to do is really seek out um, investors that you think will be aligned or will understand what you're trying to do. Um, seek out mentors. Uh, you know, I think there are a lot more uh, women, female mentors than there were uh, just a few years ago. And, and um, with the uh, with uh, these startup accelerators proliferating, and, and it's, it's easier to to find those mentors. So those are some of the ideas uh, that I would uh, recommend uh, to these women. Fabulous. And I know last time we spoke all those years ago, um, I asked you about uh, any advice for European entrepreneurs, and obviously mm -hmm. things have radically yes. changed in that area in a couple of years. It's like training to be an entrepreneur, and they say that people are getting invested in London now, which wasn't happening like seven years ago, and I was there. Um, any comments? Uh, you've obviously been in Europe recently. Mm -hmm. Would you give us any perspectives there? Tips? Yeah, so I uh, we've we've seen more seed funds get started in Europe than uh, you know a, a couple of years ago when we first spoke, as well as accelerators, and, yeah. and so uh, those ecosystems are growing. I know London just hired a uh, their first kind of digital uh, chief digital officer who's actually a woman. Woo! So uh, <laughs> you know, I think that that shows the commitment of, of David Cameron and yeah. and, and Boris uh, Johnson to to support entrepreneurs and to have a woman in that position um, is, is fantastic um, and, and a great role model yes, for, for yeah. uh, women in yeah. that market. Very inspiring. And, uh, the UK tended to be a little bit stiff and uh, the old boys club, so obviously things are really changing yes. there. And you're doing some fabulous work in third world countries like bringing te um, supporting technology. Um, anything you want to say about that? Yes, yeah, so I, I uh, really believe that there's so much potential in some of these emerging markets and these frontier markets, which I consider Africa um, and places like Indonesia. Uh, the populations are large, the middle class is growing. Um, we're seeing growth rates that um, we probably won't see in the U.S. again. Um, and uh, these entrepreneurs are, are growing up with technology and are already connected uh, to the rest of the world through social platforms and uh, social networking sites. And uh, so I, I think it's important for entrepreneurs, investors in uh, markets that are already developed to help support the entrepreneurship worldwide because it's only going to benefit us, you know, as a world as as a whole. And there's so much talent in you know every every corner of the earth right now, and that's very exciting. It is really exciting. And thank you for everything that you're doing for that cause. Thanks again for your time today, Jellic. Oh, thank you.